What's up boys and welcome back. This video is going to be a super cut of my solo series that we just finished up, which was by far the best solo season that I've ever played. This video is catered more towards new viewers or people that haven't already seen the series. Also, I'd like to say thanks for all the support I've gotten upon my return to YouTube. I definitely did not expect it and I'm going to keep going strong and pushing out loads of content for you guys every week. If you guys are new around here, be sure to subscribe and leave a like as it truly helps me out a ton. But anyways, let's go back to where it all started, over on the beach. Come here, buddy. Oh, you bastard. You are pissed. You're done, buddy. Oh my god, this thing hits like a truck. No way! Someone's been here already! Oh no. my god. What? Oh, this is a different tribe, too. These are two different tribes. Wow, two people got there before you. All right, I got to get turrets up at the speed of sound and raid this shit. All right, boys, so we got our little starter base over on Lost Island. Uh, I'm going to go for this Pearl Cave, but... Uh, there is two tribes that already have it spammed off, so I'm just gonna try to get turrets as fast as possible. And then we're gonna worry about uh, claiming it afterwards. All right, so I need to find me a nice high level RG. Just enough for me to just go around and quickly solo farm on the RG and Anki would be beautiful. After this, I'm gonna go try and get a Maywing. And then once I get the Maywing, I can get everything done very quickly. Archie traps. Alrighty. Beautiful. Got ourselves an Archie and our Nanki. Sorry to interrupt, boys, but before we continue, Vitality Trios is wiping Saturday, July 27th at 11 a.m. EST. Their CA prize is three Nintendo Switches. They have 15x harvest rates, three-man tribes, custom OSDs, custom spawns, custom drops, active admins, daily events, and a whole lot more. So if you guys are interested in playing, click the links down below, and I'll see you guys there. Oh my god, that Maywing does so much damage. Those Maywings are no joke, bro. That guy could have done some serious fucking damage to me right there. This PT has 49 Oxy. Just my luck. All right, level 90 P Maywing right here. All right, boys, that's enough for me. Let's get the hell out of here. I'm not even gonna bother. There's a guy right here, actually. Guy in flak right here. Oh. I need to get this guy far away from his PT. And he's hitting those shots. bro no oh man I don't know if I should fight this guy what the Fuck! There's a guy with the fucking shotgun!
Oh shit. All right. Someone was just at my base. That is not good. All right, well, I might get raided pretty quick here. Hopefully not, but I might. So we need to try and get off of this map, and get the resources that we need quick to uh, continue. All right, got some oil and some poly. Just need to grab some pearls real quick, and then we can go back to base, queue up some electronics, get a chainsaw, hopefully get some turrets up quick enough. I do need to get level 100 still, but I might just be able to do that by crafting some cooking pots with a 4X over on Extinction. At this point, all I had to do to get my heavy turrets was hit level 100 and get some electronics, so I went over to Extinction to kill some Spinos and farm some Enforcers. Next up on my list was to try to get a boss fight done, so I went over to Gen 1 to do the Out of the Frying Pan mission in the Volcanic Biome, so I could try to get a couple shotguns. Last one. Alright boys, so right there we got us a 140 pump, a 210 pump, and a 180 comp. As of right now, we're just kind of hoping that no one has put turrets inside of the spot we want yet. Um, but right now I'm going to go over to Crystal Isles and get some charcoal so we can make plenty of gunpowder to make some ARB for our turrets inside the cave. And one more thing I wanted to do before going for the cave was get a Therry or two so I had some sort of DPS dino to defend. Pretty shit, but I don't care. Alright, let's see what this theory tames with. This one is shit too, but I don't care. And now that I had everything that I want, it was time to go and scout the cave to see if they had turrets, and if they did, I was gonna go back and prep to raid it. auto turret oh dude tell me that's it two autos okay I gotta be quick so after I saw how weak the cave was I went back to base and crowded some rockets some turrets and some c4 and then I headed over to the cave and tried to claim it for my own Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. This guy's raiding it right now. Well, that works for you. That works for you. It definitely works for me. Oh, shit. No. I need to kill this mantis. Oh, don't get knocked. Oh, this mantis is done. It's done. Oh my god, that was fucking perfect. No turrets up here, right? No. Oh my god, is there base actually in here? The bed's gone. That's chill as fuck. Dude, those guys came to raid it at the fucking perfect time. You just instantly killed him as soon as he raided it and took it over. 
They they didn't even they <laughs> I didn't even have to kill them. They just died to their own rockets, I think. Okay, I need to lock in. I need to get foundation control. My theory took a bit of a beating, but that's fine. Oh, I got some shit from those guys. Oh! What the hell is going on in there? Is there a mantis in the water? In the water. He can't get it in. Oh, I hit it. Fuck. I just realized my May Wing is out there with all its shit on it. Oh, fuck. No! Fuck, this is not good. I'm gonna put up a pickle! There's guys here, that they, they're in the water with a mantis, but he can't quite get the mantis in, I don't think. But, I, I could put up turrets right now, but, uh, there is a mantis, that mantis is in the water, and I have the turrets. I'm a mimic. Oh, he uncrowed something! Oh, you stupid bitch. You stupid bitch! Come on, buddy. Rocket his ass. You're done! You're done! You're done! You're done, dude! <laughs> You're fucking raping them! Okay. Oh my god, why does he have so much shit? I need to get my turrets ASAP. Oh, these guys are so stupid. They should have killed my May Wing. Left off the last episode claiming the cave, and I needed some arthros to get rid of some of the mesh foundations that were inside the cave, and I also wanted to get some mantis for some base defense. Beautiful. Damn, this mantis has 47 stam. Wow. You're pissed. I am a bit pissed. Got two females. Then this one just says 44 stam, but all the other stats on both of them are ass. Stand your ass real fast. Bop. 41 HP, 35 melee. That is looking perfectly good to me. You wanna get same too, buddy? After I tamed up an Arthro for that Mesh Foundy and some Mantis that defend my base, I saw a rare Tuso spawned over on Crystal Isles, and considering I live in an underwater cave, I thought that'd probably be a good idea to get. Is it that? No. They're spawning like on the beach up here. I don't even know if I'll be able to tame it if it's up here like this. Oh, it's right here. 39 melee! I have to try to tame this thing. I don't know if I can, dude. Thirty-nine melee, dude. Seventeen HP, kind of mud, but thirty-nine melee is crazy. I don't know if you can can you just like walk up and fucking feed it. No, it has to be down, dude. Oh. Hello, 
buddy. Well, it's also still got immunity, so I don't think it's tameable yet, is it? No, no, it's. I'm pretty sure it's tameable still. Do you have to wait until immunity's out so I can aggro on you? So Ow! You can Mm, I don't think so. Oh, you dirty motherfucker. God, are you really just gonna kill the Maywing and leave? Oh my god, you fucking bitch. After that, I tried going to the center to do the alpha boss fight to get myself tech turrets, but there was way too many tribes doing it, so I wanted to test my luck doing alpha aberration. Alright boys, we're doing uh, alpha ab, because I just figured out on this server that tech grams are indeed at 120 auto unlock, so we just do this, and then we will have to farm some Ellie, but as long as we get to level 120, then we are big chillin'. Now let's just go ahead and uh, pretend that I did kill Alpha Rockwell and I didn't run out of shotgun ammo and he didn't have 10k HP left and I did get my tech in grams and yeah. After I murdered Alpha Rockwell with no problem whatsoever, I went over to look for some bases to raid in my area and I saw some guy rocketing down some turrets at this small little base here, so I thought I'd see what I could do. Alright boys, well I just found a base over here on this little ocean pillar. And someone's raiding it right now, so we're going to see what we can do here. Oh, the turrets are down, I think. No way. Man, I wish I had a Fabby right now. Holy shit.
Fuck, I could have got him right there. Oh my god. Bro, really get on his Maywing and dip. And that he did, but honestly, I still got a lot from this base. I got thousands and thousands of ingots and paste and other resources, and I could use all that to craft more heavies to put inside my cave, so in the end, I would still say that it was pretty worth it. And after I brought all that loot back to base, there were so many people that had been scouting me in the past hour or so, and considering I was solo and I had so many things to do and I was never really at my base, I thought it would be a safe bet to move into the cave. All right, boys, so we are about to move our... Uh all of our shit down into the bottom of the water. We do not have trans yet, like I said before, but kind of just gonna have to deal with that for now, I think, because we will be much safer down there, I'm pretty sure. I mean, we'll have, we could probably get like 20 heavies down there and we'll be safe. There's no grapple glitch, there's no stegos, none of that. So I think overall it will be safer down there. There'll probably be more people showing up, but if someone found my starter base over there and they just had a gas bag or a trike, they can raid it if I'm gone for like 30 minutes off map. You know, they could raid it without me getting any alerts of uh, anything going off. So from down here, I can at least play some gates, get notified, hold a little choke point. People aren't gonna really have good armor or anything, so it won't be too difficult. After that, I went to Crystal Isles to try to loot some blueprints, but I didn't really find anything good. And then I went back to base, crafted up a little bit of a crafting station, and then since I figured out that Yeti Cave on Fjorder wasn't actually able to be built in, I went over there to try to get myself some blueprints. Alright boys, current state is... Uh, nothing crazy. I've been trying to obtain some BPs for fucking actual hours now. I don't know what it is, but I think the loot quality on Crystal Isles is like bad because... I have quite literally looted well over 100 drops on Crystal Isles. All the blue drops are only prim shit. And I've gotten a bunch of flak BPs, but they're all like 250 dura or less. Earlier, I found like a 450 legs, but I died with that one, of course. But I'm just trying to get myself a pump BP right now, to be honest. So I'm going to go do... Uh, I'm going to try Yeti Cave because I think Yeti Cave isn't buildable in here. Chances are I run into people here, but... So realistically, these drops do look like they're going to be a bit better. So let's hope that's that that that's the case. But definitely no promises on that. Yeah, these see these drops are definitely not as bad as the CI drops. What we're really looking for is a pump. Buy a chest. Here. I almost killed him. Oh, he's six HP. Got him. Okay. After I killed that guy, I looted the drops for a little while longer, but I couldn't quite find what I needed, but I still really needed to get this boss fight done before I went to sleep, so I took the last pump I had left, and I went to center to try to do the boss. Hey, what? Am I 
actually doing the boss right now? I was a little bit confused because I thought I was going to take hours to get into this boss fight because there was so many people trying to do it and I did it first try, but I'm not going to complain. Alright boys, let's pray to God that I can get this fucking done because I need this so bad. Now we just need to go aggro the brood. Come on, brood. Let's get active. Oh my god. And bang. All right, 600 Ellie. Engram's gotten. Now, all we gotta hope for is that we are not being camped at the drop. Which, honestly, I did it at a pretty bad spot. Please, please. Oh my god, I'm good. Thank god. Alright, hopefully I have everything to craft what I need. Uh, surely I can... Yeah. All right, there's a rep. Maybe like 20 techs. Beautiful. All right, boys. Well, I'm going to make some quick bootleg ass wall in a second. Then I might actually be safe to go to sleep. All right, boys. All right, boys. Um, I woke up about an hour or two ago, did some editing, and uh, this is the current state of the base. Um, I don't think I clipped myself building this last night, but honestly, I don't know how I feel about this build. This build does not look very, uh, very good, but yeah, we got 60 turrets in here. Shit is looking nice right now. I'm not going to lie. Got a couple turrets out here in the water and stuff. That guy's turtle is still just chilling in the base. Um, today, I think... Uh, we're gonna try to beef out the outside a bit obviously get more ammo for the turrets and just get our general lines going Hopefully do a couple raids and stuff But uh, yeah, no one even showed up while I slept. So it's looking good so far. Uh, I have a uh, I have high hopes for the next coming days on the server All right, so uh, I believe we can open these loot boxes now and also I should be able to get Alpha dragon engrams. I don't know if I want to do ascension because if I do Ascension, it does give me... I, I can get up to level 120. And when I hit 120, I get all tech engrams. But I kind of need a transmitter ASAP. So I think I'm just going to buy Alpha Dragon. It does give me tech chest, cloning chamber, force field, some other things I need. Teleporter and vacuums. Vacuums are, are going to be very much needed for me. So I think I'm going to get Alpha Dragon. Beautiful. All right, now let's open some of these loot boxes and see what we get. Um, apparently, they buffed what you can actually get in these boxes, so I'm curious to see what kind of stats these dinos can get. Uh, if it wants to open my spyglass. See, 49 HP PT. That's, that's beautiful. Tech Rex. Some oil. Okay. Oh my god, bro. What? I got cracked flack out of that. Alright, we need more flak BPs though. More flak BPs, hopefully. And a pump BP and a fabby. Phyla BP, Rock Drake, a Thyla, Megalodon Tech Saddle. That actually might be useful. Karki, not bad. Desmo BP, that's good. Another Megalodon Tech Saddle, Rock Golem, Quetz. 92 Ascendant Desmo BP. What? Bro. 700 Dura Ramshackle legs. That's ridiculous. Uh, the gas bag BP is good. Pump is really nice. We need that for sure. Diny. Fabby, good. Giga. I mean, that Fabby's good. Ugh, Fabby's kind of mid, but... I am definitely not complaining with that. That's, uh... We got three good flak BPs, so we just need gauntlets and boots now. 
And then... Yeah, we got a pump. We got a decent Fabi. So that is what I'd like to see. Um, right now, I'm going to craft a transmitter. Oh, I think we're going to need to manually learn the S plus one. Little transmitter. Bang. Get this thing down. We definitely need to build ourselves a nice crafting station today. This is just like a little shitty temporary thing. I'm definitely not going to be using this. But build the crafting station, layer out this area, and build the space for breeders and stuff in here so we can actually get everything set up properly. All right, boys, quick little update. Um, I did a little bit of building in the base. Um, this whole area is still the same. I'm still kind of deciding on if I want to like rebuild this part or not because I do feel like the wall is a bit close and people will be able to like grapple glitch up there and stuff, but I feel like I kind of need to have it at around this distance. I could maybe put it a bit further back, but yeah, for now, the wall is looking like this. Come through here, I uh, ceilinged off the whole layers, all the layers in here, so I can put breeders everywhere. Um, I don't have any breeders set up really yet, I just have some baryonics thrown out. But yeah, I put a bunch of internals inside as well, there's heavies and techs all down here. You come upstairs, um, it looks like this, more internals, more room for tames and stuff. And then you come over here, and then this is the little crafting station I built. Um, I don't think I'm going to need anything crazy, so this will probably do for me. Maybe I'll add some more vaults and put like a tech pod and stuff in here at some point, but yeah, we got more internals up top there. Got our transmitter. I think I'm gonna do hatching just here, like next to my crafting. And then, yeah, this is looking pretty good so far. It's not very often I go this far when I'm playing solo, so I hope uh, we can get a lot of stuff done today. After I upgraded my base a bit, I went over to Scorched Earth to do a big flint and stone run to craft out some ARB for my turrets, and then I went over to the trading map because I had a couple friends on the server that weren't really going to play, so they gave me all their loot boxes and points. I'll put up a little list on the screen now with what I got because I don't want to bore you guys with all of it, but I did get most of the things I needed. And then after that, the only line I really needed still was Stegos, so I found a guy that was willing to trade me 63 HP ones, so I did that, and then I bred them up over on the trading map to get myself some eggs. Alright, I know I've been talking a lot, but I was scouting some caves on my map to look for my first raid, and I ended up deciding to go for Lost Island Crouch, so I built a little tech fob above their base, got my tames ready, and went for it. actually bricked. And these turrets are down. Alright, well. <clears throat> guess I won't be grapple glitching that. It's so weird what they have out here. Like, instead of having, like, towers or anything, they have, like, box... Like, boxes and shit. I don't even know. Anyways, let's go down. Okay, it is sick back in here. Right, I'm gonna send it in there. No, I'm stuck. I'm out of stem. Oh my god. Bro, I just broke like fucking 20 heavies with one rocket, dude. That was ridiculous. How much ammo are in this? Dude, these are poor on A or B. Oh my god. 
Now, how many turrets do they have inside? Not very fucking many, dude. I can probably just raid, like, just run this on foot real quick. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna just run this. Oh shit. Oh, there's like more turrets back there with like another wall. That's right, it's right here. Oh! The fuck? Surely I can't just run this one too, right? <laughs> fuck it. That works. Ow. Yeah, let's just leave my Giga over here. I don't know if there's another wall behind this one, but I'm just gonna send it. This cave might not even have a base in it, dude. Uh, there's something. Yeah, this is one of the tribes that was attacking my pearl cave, I think. All right, little meat run. Oh, that magma had stuff on it. Some cryoed carbos. They're all really bad. Alright, let's see if these guys got anything. I don't got much faith that these guys are really going to have anything in here, but... I'm pretty broke on mats and stuff, so honestly, I'll take whatever I can get. See, like that right there? That's beautiful. Huh. Look at these VPs, dude. That's actually a good stego VP, though. Hopefully they got a lot of metal. If it wants to stop lagging. Sadly, those guys didn't really have much that I needed. But after that, I went over to Genesis 1 with the kangaroo to try to get an easy slot cap of berries to feed my babies and make some soups. What the fuck does it got here? Oh my god, bro. What the hell? So the next raid I wanted to do was this little castle cave that's actually located right above my base as you see here. And they had a fair amount of cliff plats and foundations outside that I was going to have to get rid of first. Um, yeah, okay. There's going to be a pretty good amount of foundations that I'm going to have to break, but... Gotta do what we gotta do. Alright, so we got pretty much all of this strapped, um, except these three foundations right here, but I can't because they're too close to the clip pad, so it's C4 capped. So I'm going to blow this, pop a giga there, and then we'll try to get the rest of them down. Alright boys, let's hope this goes well. We didn't spam more vaults. Just another gate. Okay, interesting. Right, let's see what happens.
Well, I broke some stuff. Perfect. Alright, let's see what's going on in there now. Watch him place just another gate. Bro, why does he keep placing gates? This is bro's defense strat. <laughs> oh my god, man. <laughs> I'm just flying in there. The guys are just chilling on there on the... On the fucking velo. Fuck, man. Throw the stego in. God. Oh, there's a C4 trap right there! This is a C4 trap chilling there. That almost got me. Okay, I'm gonna go without the Stego first. We're gonna try to like, grapple glitch something real quick. Oh, my rocket didn't shoot, man. It's really annoying that he's got turrets up on cliff plats. Since I was having trouble getting the Stego in there, and there were some turrets that were high up that I couldn't really get to, I went back to base to heal a couple owls to try those instead. Other than that, I don't think he's changed anything, so... I'm just gonna have to send it. Ah, oh, it's still powering those other ones. No, my rocket! Why did my rocket not work? Please let me through. Oh my god. Why does he have so many door frames inside of his base? Shoot rocket. Oh, that's lagging. Just these ones now. There's one over there. Oh, 
out of ammo. Ow, bitch. Alright, I just wanna get my Giga. Oh, shit! That guy's going in. You guys better try to yoink all my shit. What are you thinking? My god. Is this the best theory in the world? Why is it doing so much damage? Oh my god, this theory is gonna beat me. Dude, that theory just straight up beat my 55 melee giga. What? How in the fuck is that possible? I had a cap saddle on my giga and everything, bro. What? Oh my god. I can't net it. I'm not sure if it can get netted or not if he like pre-netted it. Oh, he did pre-net it. Oh my god! I am off crowd timer. Oh, it's lagging. Witness this greatness. This is why I'm the best grapple player in all of Arc. This right here. This right here. You see this? Boom. Bang. Oh, I got him. Let's go. That was a crazy play. Holy shit. Oh, I just outplayed the fuck out of that guy, dude. Oh, my God. I don't know if this guy's checked like any of the loot or not. Oh, I know. Oh, I got myself on PvP timer. I'm retarded. Honestly, I'm not really going to bore you with the rest of this loot. There wasn't much. There was a bit of farm and stuff like that. But honestly, these guys were definitely kind of just restarting or something. There was not much in here. But anyways, after this, I went to take a break for a little bit to edit. And then I noticed in my Discord logs that someone was blowing spam outside my cave. So I wanted to go take a look at what was going on. All right, boys. I just logged on. Someone had blown some foundations outside the cave. I'm not sure if we're actually getting fobbed or not, but... Something's going on. Okay, we are most definitely getting fobbed. 
Look at that. Interesting. Got him. Go C4 on it. It sure does. Okay. shooting. Oh, he had a bunch of C4 and shit on him. Uh, we'll take that. They got found in control pretty close. Yeah, that's exactly what they were trying to do. Oh, that guy is so lucky. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, that guy is so lucky. Oh my god. How's this motherfucker living? Yeah, well my water turrets are not gonna last very long, I don't think. So at this point, they dropped a couple of turrets I had in the water when I was gone for a couple minutes. So now all I had to do was defend the cave, and I was just blocking the crouch point with a Theri, and then eventually a Stego, and they were not having it. Perfect. You're done. Oh my god, I'm dead. Hello. Hello. Oh my god, man! Hello? Hello? Stop your message, please. I can't. I, I can't access it. Okay, but then, like, remove your dialogue blocking, you know? It's not allowed. I don't want to make a ticket. Dialogue blocking entrance is um, not allowed, you know? <laughs> Fun fact, okay. dino blocking is actually allowed, and I can put up the five dinos in the entrance. So these guys, uh, I don't know if they were just lying to me or what they were doing, but yeah, they ended up making some tickets on me, but it didn't really go anywhere. <laughs> uh, these guys are just pissed off that I'm like blocking the entrance to the cave with dinos. And I'm just like... spawning new ones. I'm spawning like 70,000 HP Stegos and just they're sitting there and I think try to kill them every time. <laughs> oh, I'm dead again. Oh, never mind. All these. How? No! Oh, he's retarded. He is so retarded. Do you guys like my Stego? Yet, uh, not a lot, by the way. 
It is allowed. It's not. Make a ticket then. It's allowed. I can do it. I did already. Alright, what is he gonna say? Is he gonna tell me that I need to get banned? Yeah, I'll tell you. I'll tell you when, 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 what they say. I'm allowed max five dinos at once, man. I can keep putting these here all day. What did you say? I can do max five dinos at once. I can put these here all day, bro. Nope. Shouldn't have even told him that. Oh, I, I sure you. can. No, yeah, you're allowed to do it, man. Does not know what you want me to say? He doesn't need that. If I eat poly, I instantly die. Oh, really? Yeah. The grappling hook up. So if they hook you, you're just gonna eat it quick and die? That's the plan, but the pr thing is I have to be standing like on ground to like actually eat something or consume something. So if I'm in the water, they might get me, but I'll just try to cut the grapple and not get knocked out. But... Oh. You're dead. <laughs> yeah, I told the admin, I said, yo, is this allowed? And I sent him like a screenshot of what I'm doing. He's like, yeah, you can have max five dinos blocking it at once. <laughs> And I'm oh like, yeah, God. they said they're making tickets on me, and like, yep, they're always going to. You dead, Barry Onyx? Oh my god! <laughs> it's <What>? even. <laughs> oh, it, it's have... it's so AIDS for them, dude. Oh my god! Are they trying to kill it, and it's like not doing anything? No, I just have another Dino here now. So they're loving that. Oh, so they can't even get past ah, that bit? Ah, free blocking now. Okay. Yeah, I'm allowed, man. <laughs> you're not, you're not. Yeah, I am. <laughs> you gotta tell, tell them the, the bag. Are you gonna cry about it or, or no? You have to now get down on your... the rule is. Come tell me. I asked the admin, man. I'm friends with him. I'm good to go. You're not. I am, man. You know, Quincy, he's chill. If you get down on your hands and knees and beg me, I might remove it. What? If you get down on your hands and knees and beg for them to be removed, I might remove them. Fuck okay. <laughs> That's even worse! Oh my god, they're gonna- they're just loving this. I could dump on them. <laughs> You're not even chill like that? Nah, but I mean, unless- unless the admin I asked uh, didn't know the rules, I don't know. Well, if that is the case, then blame it on him and then you don't take the warning. Yeah, I mean, I read the rules. It's not in the rules either, so unless Bro writes it in the rules right now. That's what he's doing AFK right now. Are you just here for the mesh turret or what? You here to watch yeah, yeah, me? I'm leaving now. Yeah, Wait, no, who, no, is, I'm leaving who, who is this? Really, sister? Oh my god! Oh my god, baby! Good luck, friend. You like, you like bro. my blocking dinos, bro? Yeah. Yeah, I think they like them too. How long have you been popped for? I don't know, like two hours, but I'm I'm solo. I've been solo all white. I'm gaming. Uh, enjoy. Have fun. Right. Peace out, bro. You hear that, boys? I can keep my dinos there. Isn't that sick? <laughs> so mad right now. I got about two more fridges of Stegos ready to be popped right there, man. This is gonna be so pissed off. I'm gonna place as many heavies as possible so they get shredded harder with the crap of which. Really fucking hard to see them in there. Anything about that much? That didn't a lot. There you go. Now they're gonna grab me. Yeah. 
Grapple glitch. What if you grappled him out of the air while he was doing it? <laughs> that guy died instantly. Wow! Oh. Cut it quick! Oh my god! Damn! Holy <laughs> shit! Oh my god! Well, let me grapple you, buddy. I'm just gonna put I'm just gonna put the double door frames back a little bit further. Yeah. So it's harder for them to blow them up and even if the stagger goes back to like where those foundies are right now, uh, they just blocked it even more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really even if here. The stagger goes yeah, even if it goes back that far, like there's it's still gonna be in the way. It's still gonna LOS shit, yeah. Alright, let's see if I can grapple glitch C4. Oh my god, I, I broke two heavies. So at this point, it was getting really late for them, and they kind of stopped doing things for about one or two hours. So I went to sleep myself because it was getting really late over where I was. And then when I woke up about two hours later, they were still doing things in logs. And I knew these guys weren't going to get in, but I also really wanted to go and upgrade my base myself. So I went and invited someone to come and help me. You don't have LA? I only have like 80 LA left right now. Didn't we just buy some? Uh, LA oh yeah, you get no LA when you buy Yeah, it's like yeah. 800 points for 10. It's not worth so the whole outside of this base is all 6x, so when Shock has joined the tribe, we knew it was going to be an easy Stego Rex push, so we got to it. Oh, when did you put <laughs> Don't see for it. Oh, you didn't get it. Right. No way. Let's go this corner. Let's Our band one. Oh, three men. Turn real quick. Oh, a vibe to like. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck Careful. You. Yeah, you just stand it and then. Disabled homing rockets. Fuck. It defeated you to the bird game. That's bird game. Yeah, he put me in the back of the bird game, man. Oh, did it? No. Oh. Oops. All Esper structures will have 3x crafting speed and smelting speeds. Yeah. Jesus. Like this. Add an awesome spyglass and remove it binoculars. That's a nice thing beer. How to copy a third? How to make a third? Change the third limit from 110 to 90. Um. Pack will cap the 200%. All right, right all I say, man. Tame, all tamed dinos. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. What? Why, why am I dying in my own base? I don't know. Why have you just TP me so you could take it up there? <laughs> Where did I TP? Oh, the wobble. Yeah, bro, not on like that type of a low boosted server, it's not going to be good. Is that low boosted? It's like 50 sticks now. On oh, is it? He's, he's oh. rebuilding some vax in there. Oh, is this free, man? Oh, I thought this was yeah. six, man. Oh. Well, um, I think it's time to <laughs> stream in or making videos on it. Then it's actually just gonna hold pop because people are gonna watch and be like, "Oh, that actually looks really fun." I'm gonna hop on and do a late start. Go, go for those two heavies. On the, on the ground there? there? Yeah. Dude, I've been waiting for you. What the fuck have you been? Oh, this yo, green. Snip, you've got some wow, that's good. Cool. I think the turret cap is just to the left of the vacuum that's there. I'm pretty sure. I can probably just go for that after. Yeah, yeah, you should, you should, and I can just push up turrets. Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah, you you go stand it. Oh. Got rid of my cakes, unfortunately. It's fine. Alright, this thing has a bit more oxy, so I'm just gonna straighten out a little bit. Are you trying to grapple you careful? I need to straighten out, I'm going like completely sideways. Just be quick, be quick, be quick. 
It's not nearly as many turrets this time, so we can live for a lot longer. As long as we don't get grappled. Yes, the Megalodon's boosting me. You're basically getting blocked by I mean, I bought bullets. a C4 off this thing? No, you can't, you can't. <laughs> I wish I could, bro. Are you going crazy right Just now? Just my Uber. Just my Uber. Swear. No, that doesn't get it. Oh my god. Debris, debris. This axe is in this room. It was the turret cap there, though, no? It's, it's in like a crevice on the left, I think. Oh, I'm out of stamina. So I'll die so this kid doesn't cage me. Big um, uh, what do we meet? Where, where do you want me to go? I'll just transfer. Quickly, quickly, what quickly, 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 quickly. Yeah, hold on. I went through my Bro, fucking Bro, fear him. Side. You're fucked. I, I was building. I was fucking building the oh. below. Bro, I was gonna say, I don't know if I'd be going out with 100 heavies on me. What the hell? Why like why do you keep getting full? I don't know. Bro, oh I'm saying this. This is The Jenny's right there in that one, Chuck. That's right there. You can't share on this one. No. We are gonna do it. What might be? We're gonna like kind of share one might and see how it goes. Yeah. Chuck, the Jenny's right there, like right right in that vacuum you just broke. It's on the ground. There you go. We're not necessarily uh we're not necessarily gonna promote it. Ooh, like it'd be like, oh, oh you're gonna kind yeah, share whatever do you want. Well, you gonna, you should, uh, you, you should build a poll where they say like, should we allow rotating or something? So me and Shawkus ended up dropping pretty much all of their fob in about two pushes, and they ported everything out of the fob, and we dropped this last little bit, and then we went to go look for a raid to do. Hey, what? What the fuck is all? Oh, all right, I need, I need, I need a beer. I died instantly. Oh my, oh my fucking god. He's lagging. Where do you? Yeah, Ooh. there we go. Now they're gone. Bring it over in just a second. Okay. I'll be enough for now. Bro! I had teleport, no. and then when I teleported in, <laughs> it fucking blew up. I shot my rocket. Yo, we're actually, at the same time. we're the best duo so in I, our history, holy. <laughs> so I killed you. <laughs> oh, I see. I see the outlet. If we go, like, the bottom, like, middle of the wall, it's like, I think if we hit that, they don't have a tech jenny, so. How far back can I go here? I can't see shit because of the bodies, bro. Yeah. Oh, hatch for him. Well, I got rid of it at least. <laughs> no right idea where this big single crit is, I'm not gonna lie. Hello? There we go. Yeah. Dude, that's insane. <laughs> yeah, it is. You die so much faster than you think, right? <laughs> Oi! Oh, nice. Got out of one of the shot. Nice. Taking my damage? Uh, sure. I don't have that many rockets though. Out of uh, out of rockets, out of soak. I mean, I bet, don't, I bet they don't have much ammo. Uh, they're out of ammo. Come in. There is a Giga in the fall if you want to grab it. I brought one.
Well, they don't have a trance, so... Oh shit, they whistled aggressive. It's like a gander at what they've got. It's up to you, I mean, I put the gig on, man. I feel bad, dude. I kind of feel bad, too, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, sure. You, you make the decision. We can just leave it if you want. I just saw him in here. Where the fuck did he go? He cried the stego. Hey, man, whistle passive. Is this guy a computer? <laughs> what is he doing? Might be. <laughs> Mesa's new AI fake pop. Hey, man, whistle okay. passive. And that's going to be all for today, boys. In the next one, we start up a new series over on Mesa's four-man server with a few of the boys. I know this video wasn't insanely long. It wasn't the longest series ever, but for me playing solo, I think I did a pretty good job. And as always, if you guys did enjoy, be sure to subscribe and leave a like as it truly helps me out a ton. And I'll see you guys in the next one.